You gotta go party. You gotta go party. Let's go party. Get over here. You want some water? You want some water, Bubba? What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. I just got done getting my little morning skincare routine done, letting the dog out and feeding him. Now I'm about to make some coffee and some breakfast. Today is Friday, November 12th, 8 o'clock in the morning. Usually I'm working on Fridays, but today I'm not working because my husband is actually having eye surgery this afternoon. So I have to, you know, take him there, care for him and everything. So I figured I would just do a quick morning routine since I have the morning free. So I'm gonna make some coffee like I do every morning. Get the stuff out of the fridge that I need. And usually in the mornings I'll have a coffee and a protein shake but I don't really know if I want a protein shake right now or if I just want an actual breakfast because usually I have like my breakfast at like 10 o'clock or something. But since he has his surgery and we probably have to leave here like around noon or whatever, I want to be like extra full for the day until I can eat again because I don't know how long that's gonna be. But let's make my coffee real fast and then I will decide on my breakfast. I've been putting pumpkin pie spice in my froth for a few months now and it's just so good. Then I'm also gonna put some of this Jordan Skinny Syrup Salted Caramel Mocha in there too. I'm gonna put this one in my froth and then a different one in my coffee. Not a lot, just to give it a little bit of flavor. You know, a little bit of that Christmassy flavor. I was gonna show you guys the coffee that I've been having lately. So I've been liking it, it's a decaf coffee, but I always get my bag of coffee and then I pour it into here and I guess I poured all of it into there and then threw it away. I can't remember the brand of it, but next time I get it, I'll have to show you guys because I actually really like it. It's decaf and you literally can't taste the difference, but I'm gonna put some of this peppermint bark flavoring in my coffee along with a little bit of stevia just to give it a little bit of sweetness. And yeah, that's my morning coffee. Pretty much I have this coffee every single day. I just kind of rotate my flavors out. I'll show you guys all my flavors. So I am obsessed with these flavorings if you cannot tell. I have so many. This Christmas cookie, hazelnut, glazed donut, white chocolate mocha, cinnamon vanilla, salted caramel squirrel, vanilla almond, caramel fudge waffle cone. I like to put this one in my like smoothies and stuff. It literally makes it taste like ice cream. And then chocolate caramel truffle. So these are just the ones that I have right now. Obviously that one's not up there yet. And then this one goes behind there. So it's kind of like really busy, but I pick a random one every single day. So I really like to have all of them setting out. I get all these from TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Home Goods, any store like that. I think maybe Bed Bath and Beyond has them too, but Marshalls and TJ Maxx and Home Goods is where I get them from. And this is my favorite part of my coffee. Like, I have to make sure you guys see it because it's just always so good. Look at that foam. Oh my gosh. So good. Mmm, 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 mmm. Starbucks who?
And I always drink my coffee through a straw because, you know, we're trying to protect those white teeth. Don't need no coffee stains on my teeth, so. Teeth? I think I said teeth. I meant teeth. So good. Now I'm gonna make a shake. I decided just to have a shake to keep it simple and then I'll probably try and eat again before we leave. But I just put ice in my blender. Then I'm gonna add some of this protein to it. It smells exactly like hot chocolate. It's pretty good. Then I'm gonna add some of this maca powder, just a little teaspoon or tablespoon, whatever. Then I'm also going to add some green, whatever this is, super greens powder. Get in, you know, some good veggies. You can't even taste this in your drink, so that's why I like to add it. And then I'm going to add a little bit of this powdered peanut butter to make it a little more peanut buttery. And I'm also going to add half a banana. Sit. Be nice. Take it. Good boy. And then I usually take my vitamins and stuff at night because the prenatal pill that I was taking like made me feel so nauseous when I took it in the morning. But I just got a new one today and I don't know, I'm gonna try and take them in the mornings again. So yeah, I'm gonna take my vitamins. Oh God. Okay, it's a little bit later. Jared and I sat on the couch for a while and talked. And I just scrolled through Shein's website looking to see if there's anything new that I want. But it is now 9.38 and I drank my protein shake, but I haven't drank my coffee yet. Which now it's mostly cold, but I don't mind it, so whatever. Now I'm just gonna sit here and either watch a YouTube video or watch an episode of Friends. I don't think I've updated you guys yet in my vlogs. I started watching Friends finally and I think I'm on like season two episode like 10 or something like that, 10 or 11. I'm really enjoying it so far. It's pretty funny and I know it is long, long, long overdue. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna watch a vlog or something because my YouTube is already pulled up on my TV, so why not? The Midnight Twins uploaded a Christmas decorate with me video, so I think I might watch that just because we love a good Christmas moment. I love Christmas and I can't wait to decorate. Last year, I did a Christmas decor. What is up with my hair? I don't know. Last year, I did a Christmas decorating vlog or whatever, and we decorated for Christmas like the first weekend of November just because that's how I like it. I want to enjoy my Christmas decorations for ever before we have to take them down. So I like to decorate like right after Halloween. My husband is not like that. He is, we have to wait until the day after Thanksgiving or Thanksgiving day to decorate. And I'm just like, whatever. So I decided like each year, we're just gonna go back and forth on decorating when he wants to decorate and decorating when I wanna decorate. So last year we decorated when I wanted to decorate. So this year I'm waiting on when he wants to decorate. So that might be Thanksgiving day, the day after Thanksgiving, I don't know, but sucks, but he like tries to play it off. He's like, since we decorated so early last year, I'm not gonna choose to decorate until like Christmas Eve. And I'm like, okay, well we can do that, but just know that next year I get to decide again and we're gonna put up the Christmas tree on 4th of July so <laughs> it's so funny but he thinks he's smart but he's not so yeah enough about decorating and stuff I'm gonna watch this video drink my coffee and then probably put my makeup on and stuff and do my hair so it's not so crazy anymore you guys look at my messy freaking vanity like it has been this messy since we got back from Colorado which was three weeks ago four weeks ago something like that and I have not let it be this messy since moving my beauty room to this setup. It's kindly just to the point where it's driving me crazy and I want to get it cleaned up. So I'm gonna clean it up real fast before I do my makeup so that it can be looking much, much better because this just isn't gonna work for me no more. Like, look how messy this is. I would literally have to like dig through here to find something that I'm gonna use. 
And just like that, everything is picked up and put away and it looks so much better. I'm so happy with it even though I'm about to do my makeup again. I'm going to put everything away once I get done using it. So that is good. My mirrors are super clean and we are ready to rock and roll. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's not enough to see it. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's not enough to see it. Must be something bad features. You find the beauty goes much deeper. Once you get to meet her, you see her walking down the boulevard. She got the posture of a superstar. She looks so fly in those Gucci slides. Yeah, yeah, I wonder where she hides under her disguise. Yeah, 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 yeah. And all the girls around the To see her. There must be something about her features. You'll find her beauty goes much deeper. Okay, I just finished getting ready. I did my hair up in a little updo. I was watching the Midnight Twins and Abby had her hair kind of up like this. And I was like, that is so cute. So I'm going to do it. So I just threw my hair up. And then I put on this cute little outfit. This is a sweater from Hollister. It's like this cream color. Um, it's a size medium. And I got it like a few years ago for Christmas from my parents. Paired it with some faux leather leggings from Walmart. And then with my little combat boots from Marshalls, I've been a obsessed with these and I've just tried to wear them every chance I can and yeah I don't know why I got so dressed up but it's a vibe. Can I just say that I finally cleaned my mirror so it's not so dirty looking for all my pictures and you know my outfit of the day videos. Um, but yeah gonna get ready to go to the place where Jared's having a surgery. Maybe get something to eat before we go. I don't know how much time we'll have or maybe if he's filling up to it we can grab something to eat when we are on our way home but I'm gonna close the video out here because it is almost noon it's 11 45 so yeah if you liked it make sure to give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below what you want to see next um I'm going to be doing a night routine tonight maybe or sometime this weekend so if you want to see that make sure you stay tuned subscribe and until next time I will see you in my next video bye guys thanks for watching and go out and make the world smile stars in the sky you stay past by your face Trip up to Mars, hold you tight in my arms.